food banks in Memphis and across the country are bracing for a surge in demand. It's because extra SNAP benefits for roughly 30 million Americans ended this week. This afternoon, we take a look at how the Mid-South Food Bank is preparing to see an increase in demand as they try to put food on more tables. For many families already struggling during the COVID-19 shutdown with job losses and now rising inflation, they had been able to qualify for extra money for food. But those benefits have ended, even as the cost of groceries continues to rise. It seems like the cat eats better than I do sometimes. I'm thinking other families, you know, could use that extra $100, especially the ones that have children. The Supplemental Nutrition Assistance Program, or SNAP, is run by the U.S. Department of Agriculture. SNAP helps low-income families buy food and, during the pandemic, allow participants to receive the maximum monthly benefit to cushion the blow of COVID-19. But those extra benefits ended this week, even as congressional leaders clashed over the need to help families versus abuse. It uplifted over 2 million people above the poverty line. 93 billion over the next 10 years. The pandemic cannot be used as an excuse. At the Mid-South Food Bank on South Perkins, many families rely on SNAP benefits. We've seen an increase over this, the last couple of years of about maybe 10 to 15 percent of people needing SNAP benefits. The food bank has SNAP outreach coordinators in Tennessee and Mississippi to help people with applications. They're bracing for a surge. With SNAP being cut, we will see an increase of people coming to our um, partner agencies and needing food. So we will see an ex like more people coming in. Now, as many people look for new ways to help feed their families, the Mid-South Food Bank says they'll be around to help. As long as we have it and we, you know, the, the food's coming in, the money's coming in for us to purchase food. And if anybody wants to donate money or food, that will help our community as we may see this surge. And the Mid-South Food Bank also says many families can find additional help by visiting mobile food pantries, brick and mortar pantries, churches and soup kitchens all in the Memphis area.